Happy International Dog Day. For the Anna Shelter, every day is dog day. But for me, and, and actually everybody here, like, it's an everyday, like, that's my life. You know, if, if you scroll through my phone, every picture is of my dogs or somebody's dogs, you know? So, um, yeah, to me, it feels like every day is International Dog Day. Dogs create oh such God, a bond with so their small. humans that they become part of the family. To, to us, they're family. And the same way we celebrate our families and the people that are important to us, um, the animals are just as important. And t again, to us, that is their part of the family. One local woman found such a What's bond at the Anna Shelter. And how do you spell? Man, it was when I, it was hard going into the Anna Shelter and not taking them all back with me. But it was, I don't know, something in her eyes and the way that she was just, I could tell she just was not doing well in the shelter. and. So, I don't know, I just, I brought her home and she's, we're exactly alike in, in so many ways. So it was a really good connection. In order to adopt, the Anna Shelter does have some rules. For us here, um, you have to have permission from either your landlord or own your own property. So the animal has to be welcome on the property. Everybody in the family has to be on board with this decision. Um, an animal knows when it's not wanted. So I don't want a situation where mom and the kids really want a dog, but dad's not on board. Like that's not gonna work here. Um, a source of income is so important. Animals cost money. Um, not just the adoption fee, but once you add in, you know, proper flea control, proper vaccines, um, the fact that they can get sick or injured and you have to be prepared for all that. So a source of income is very important. Um, and just being prepared time-wise. So it doesn't matter if your dog is large or small, love them each and every day. Happy International Dog Day. And make sure to send us pictures of your dogs in the comments below. Emma Rose Lewis, YourEerie.com.